All right, guys, I'm back with you. I had to wait for a damn train to pass through. <clears throat> here in North Carolina, they just come through at all times of the day. It doesn't matter what time. They just come through here holding their horn down like somebody's on the tracks for an hour. But uh, anyways, back to the cigar review. Like I said, I'm getting some really strong notes of pepper and spice off of this cigar. And... Uh, it's just amazing it, it's just the exhale on this thing is very strong so you know if you if you smoke mild cigars or even medium cigars you definitely probably want to sit down smoking this one because this is a pretty stout stick um, you know overall the burn it looks like it's burning very consistent so far the wrap on it's really interesting it's like a reddish brown color um, it's really similar to the uh, I don't know if you can see it here in this video or not. It's really similar to the color of the Antonio by Hoya de Nicaragua. But, uh, and the band's really cool as well. It says Gotham Cigars. It doesn't say anything about Alec Bradley on the cigar, but um, if you go on their website, it gives you a rundown of, uh, you know, uh, the fact that Alec Bradley put these out exclusively for them. And uh, I believe it's the first lineup that they're actually doing for exclusive cigars to Gotham. So, you know, you might as well pick up at least a five-pack of these. They're only $19.99 and give them a try. You know, if you don't like them, give them out to your friends. But, uh, you know, take my word for it. I, this is a very tasty stick so far. Let me, get another, let me get another nose exhale off of this cigar, and I'll tell you a little bit more about what I'm getting. Some other notes other than pepper and spice. definitely has a nutty a nutty cocoa -y, uh aftertaste and you can definitely still pick up the uh, notes of, of uh, there's even notes of cedar in here which is really interesting you know I'm sitting here trying to taste it uh, but uh, what else am I getting out of this cedar spice pepper a little bit of a woodsy earthy taste not too much woodsy and earthy a little bit um, right now it's just really still hitting on a lot of pepper and spice it's, it's really it hasn't mellowed out at all yet it's got a really beautiful ash on it here really beautiful ash. I don't know if you guys can see this or not. Really white in color. I think that means it's uh, rich in uh, oh god, what is it? Is it rich in uh, I don't remember. It's rich in something in the in the ground that's uh, some kind of a uh, nutrient. <laughs> I don't remember. Uh, maybe uh, zinc or something like that. I don't remember what it is, but uh, anyways, I'll correct myself if I'm wrong in the next video. Uh, but overall, I'm very pleased with this cigar. I'm a third of the way through it. And uh, it's kind of windy out here today, so it's making it burn a little faster. And uh, excuse this uh, table thing here. The awning's getting blown away in the wind. I don't have a tie down for it. But uh, yeah. Go ahead, do yourself a favor, pick yourself up a five pack of these cigars, give them a try. You know, if you don't like them, give them out to your friends. But I really think you're going to like this, especially if you like full bodied cigars. So, uh, you know, Cigar Bob's giving you some good advice here. You know, I would advise you to take it and at least try them. And, uh, you know, look around their website, see what else they got. Um, uh, if you go to my website, it's uh, http www.cigarconyacente.com. And, uh, you know, go to my cigar reviews. You can pull up, uh, you know, all the videos I have. And they're going to have links where you can buy these sticks or any of the other sticks I'm reviewing. And uh, it's going to give you a little bit more rundown on the prices. It's going to give you a rundown on the profiles and the flavors. Um, and anything I might not mention in these videos. So, you know, uh, look forward to the next video coming soon. Probably tomorrow when I get off work. And um, I'm not sure what I'm going to be reviewing. Um, but I will get back with you guys very soon. 
Hope you had a great Monday. Thanks, guys. Later.